Yes, Mr. Ma Allen, did you or did you not decriminalize public urination in no, Washington, D.C.? Did you lead the charge to do so? No, it, the revised criminal code left that as a criminal charge. Did you lead the charge to decriminalize public urination in Washington, D.C.? No, ma'am. Did revised you ever criminal vote code in favor of decriminalizing public urination in Washington, D.C.? Lauren Boebert is trying really, really hard to get a soundbite out of this House hearing that was held in regard to crime and homelessness in Washington, D.C. Mr. Allen, based on these statistics, I, I would like to talk to you um, about some, some other things um, that are going on here in Washington, D.C., specifically an initiative that you led. In November of 2022, you led the charge to reform D.C.'s crime laws. Is that correct? I chaired the committee that that proposal came You through. led this charge, yes, sir. And uh, these charges, these changes are now law here in D.C., correct? Do you mean the revised criminal code? Yes. Uh, no, those are not the law. Those are not the law. Did, with you, the, you the revised, revised you, you criminal code them. was uh, rejected by... Excuse me, Mr. Chairman, I'll talk to Mr. Allen. So bad. Excuse me, Mr. Allen. I just love how she just ignored what he said. Like just completely yeah, ignored what like, he said. Uh, I like my version better. <laughs> I'm gonna stick with this one. Oh, and I'm gonna need it because the stuff that's coming next is worse for me. Dude, you could tell that she's also panicking. Like it's not going the way she she's wants gotta to be go. enraged at her team. Assuming she's a habit, she couldn't get a single fact right. But if you thought that was bad, it's about to get worse for Bobert. And you know I love it. Let's watch. Yes, Mr. Allen, did you or did you not decriminalize public urination in no, Washington, DC? Did you lead the charge to do so? No, it, the revised criminal code left that as a criminal charge. Did you lead the charge to decriminalize public urination in Washington, D.C.? No, ma'am. Did the revised you ever criminal vote in favor of decriminalizing public urination in Washington, D.C.? The revised criminal code that was did passed you by the ever council support, kept it as a criminal offense. Did you, did, and you support this? Criminal I voted for it, yeah. You voted to keep it as a criminal offense. That's correct. The full council did. We have records that show that you were in favor of removing that criminal offense and allowing public urination. No, the- Is that something that you intend to pursue in the future? No, the legislation that you're referring to that came from the Criminal Code Reform Commission changed public urination from a criminal to a civil offense. The council then changed that to maintain it as a criminal offense at the request of the mayor. Thank you, I yield. I bet you do. <laughs> Um. <laughs> I yield and can I leave, please? <laughs> I have somewhere to be. I left my oven on. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> she sounds like she she has a pee fetish or something. Like she's I, so fired she up. She desperately <laughs> wants like like just her 15 minutes of water sports fame on the national stage. Like, I gotta get him on the peeing, please. Please, oh give me God. something, a dribble, oh something. <laughs> <sighs> Sir, I've received a leak from your office. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You say you're against it, but we've got evidence on your pants that implies that you've, <laughs> it's just like, this is an actual job. Being a congressperson, being involved in these hearings is an actual thing. I understand that a lot of stupid people have made their way through Congress and they make it look pretty easy. But it's an actual job that deserves serious consideration and no, work. No, no, considering how ineffective Congress has been at accomplishing anything, I just want to take this time to personally thank Congresswoman Boebert for doing something, mm -hmm. which is providing some comedic relief in this unbearable and devastating news cycle. With that said, let's watch others laugh at her. I've been addressing a number of really serious concerns that our constituents have. Uh, they're choosing to waste our time by meddling in the District of Columbia and talking about public urination over and over, just wanna make sure, do you have anything additional you wanna say about public urination? Now's your time. I do. Um, um, no, not you, I'm talking to, <laughs> it's, not, it's not your time. It's, uh, it's, a, it's a question I'll wait to these people up. who have I do come have something here. else to say.
I know sometimes it's hard when you want to go, but just hold it for like a little bit longer, please. We're trying to have a conversation here. <laughs> No, put put your hand down. It's to, we're doing something right now. You can't go. Oh my you can't god, do it. this was the best story I've covered in a long time. Thank you for adding it to the rundown. This is amazing. <laughs> I had not seen any of these videos until now. They're amazing. And it's and all not to be a downer. All of this is just about someone who again pretends to support the the forgotten masses or whatever, just trying to demonize unhoused people. That's. All that this is yes, about. Yes, yes. I mean, look, her intentions are nefarious and disgusting. So let's be clear about that. Mm -hmm. But let's cue up that last video that we watched again. Um, doesn't mean we can't laugh at her. Sure. Because <laughs> she deserves to be laughed at. I gotta watch that one more time. I'm sorry, please indulge me. Let's do it. I've been addressing a number of really serious concerns that our constituents have. Uh, they're choosing to waste our time by meddling in the District of Columbia and talking about public urination over and over. Just want to make sure, do you have anything additional you want to say about public urination? Now's your time. I do. Um, um, no, not you. I'm talking to, <laughs> it's, not, it's not your time. It's, uh, it's, a, it's a question I'll wait to till these your time's people up. who have I do come have here. Else to say. Uh, I die. It's, I do. She is just so utterly self-destructively confident in herself. Confidence is generally a good thing. We teach kids you should have confidence, but some <laughs> some shouldn't because it gets them in trouble. Sometimes a bit of humility, humility would be better for you. That is the problem with Lauren Boebert. Too many participation trophies clearly, in her lifetime. Yeah, clearly, absolutely.